The results are in. The toxicology reports Amy Winehouse drank herself to death. That is according to the reports by the London Coroner's Office. Though originally the London Coroner's report was delivered to the wrong address, when it finally reached her parents, the results were clear. Amy's blood level of 416, noted in the toxicology report, was too much for her to survive four times the legal driving limit. She died as a result of alcohol poisoning, according to the family. The five-time Grammy winner was found dead in her London apartment on July 23rd of 2011. The family was relieved to finally learn of Winehouse's cause of death. It comes as a relief to the family to finally find out what happened to her. Her family also said that Amy had been drinking steadily for several days prior to the alcohol overdose that finally put an end to the 27-year-old's life. At only 24, Winehouse had six Grammy nods and five wins. When she died at 27, her ex-husband, Blake Fielder Civil, was in jail. Her parents had always allegedly exhibited questionable judgment, and the paparazzi always followed her relentlessly. It was no wonder the pressure was apparently more than she could bear. From the Christian Post Newsroom, I'm George J. Weinbarg.